I especially, I think what makes other people laugh is me standing next to you anywhere because you make me look like Timothy Chalamet. <laughs> so, uh, I am Ryan. I'm Gal. And I am Freckles, also known as Dwayne. <laughs> <laughs> That's just the name he dances under. And we're here to test how well. We know each other. Yeah. What is my biggest fear? Um, I'm done. But I, I went, to, I'm serious, I'm not like funny. Are you doing a funny one? I'm, I do. may or may not be, I'm not gonna help you here. It's nicking his privates uh, when shaving. <laughs> That's a good one, I didn't think wow. about this one. That's wow. scary. I know that for a I fact. I would be scared. Would We've be had scared. a couple drinks together, haven't we? Yeah. <laughs> wow. Now I'm very heavy. Yeah. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> Losing a loved one. Wow. Oh, Whoa. Wow. God forbid. Right? Yeah. I mean. You don't care that much. No, no, no. I mean, there's a couple uncles <laughs> that, let's be honest, but um, wow. Well, both are terrifying, but, but actually, I went with something sort of in the middle. Here we go. Airplanes. Airplanes. Really? What? Not big on airplanes. No. Wow. Not big at all on airplanes. I, I do. I fly all the time, but I can't stand it. I've had a couple of events. I've had a couple of, you know, like close calls in them. I've had a couple where everyone went flying and hit the roof. I've no. had a couple, yeah. You have, you, I remember, you, we talked about that. I, Legit, I, we talked about yeah. that. Yeah, I had a skydiving accident when I was 19 where my chute didn't open, <gasps> and that is what, where it started. I started to, to get a little in my head about heights, and then it got into airplanes, and then the whole thing went crazy, wow. yeah. My chute didn't open, but I had a reserve which my, in my idiot thinking as I'm flying through the air, I was thinking like, I'm not gonna pull my reserve because then I'll, I'll, I'll have no <laughs> shoots left after that. <laughs> and then finally I was like, well, you know what, I should pull the reserve. And, not, and I pulled it and I landed goodness. miles away and since then I've been terrified of flying. Wow. Oh, there you go. I didn't know that. Yeah, yeah. I would sooner moonwalk to New York from Los Angeles than... Or shave. Or nick myself shaving. <laughs> <laughs> my junk, no problem. What was my favorite scene to film in Red Notice? Then. Well, Freckle says, any scene with Ryan and I. Oh. Anyone. Oh, I should have brought that <laughs> That wasn't it. I think it was kicking DJ and Ryan's asses. Yes. Aww. So, uh, actually, I'm very sincere in this one, so I need to, so it was the dancing scene uh, that I did with uh, DJ uh, that was fun and walk and talk and dance and do the whole thing and I really enjoyed it. Ginger really and Fred, was. you guys did great. It really was, thank you. Next time we'll sing well, I had too. a great dance partner. DJ is a big guy and I was a bit nervous. Uh, my, my toes were a bit nervous. Uh, but he, you are such a good dancer. Like butter. But like, I had a great partner. But like if way. I ever, which it never happened, but if I ever, in, we can go to Dancing with the Stars together. And, well, and we'll and probably we'll, take the first place because this guy's well because of her, but we like crush ballerina. It. And I would beat anyone's Light ass. Feet. I highly this. doubt you're in their budget. <laughs> Let's just call it Let's real, right? Let's, yeah. Yeah. Let's just be real. You never know. <laughs> if I wasn't an actor, what would I do for a living? Holy oh crap. man! Right. Uh, um, okay, okay, I know, I know. Let's I would say President wow. of the United States you of America. <laughs> Thank you so much. Guys. He's a good friend. He's a good Way friend. Way to get Ryan topical. Just, just <laughs> vomited in his mouth. He's a good mouth. friend. No, no, I, I was going to say he'd be a, a general in the armed forces of some kind, mm -hmm. which I think is pretty, pretty great. Oh. Or and it's the same a one. pumpkin butter salesman. <laughs> <laughs> just a door-to-door -door pumpkin butter salesman. DJ is always unexpected in his you entrepreneurial pursuit. Really so, I, yeah, See? it's a scalable business. It's a growth industry, so really I don't know. Maybe, yeah, <laughs> sign this for you, DJ. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you very much. Yep. Thank you. No I love it. Well, I said I would be a haiku poet. A what? Wow. A what haiku a poet. poet. That's wow. a hard medium. It really, <laughs> Very niche. A really hard yes. medium. Out of the ass, I pulled that answer. Yeah, yes, I it. mean, it's a beautiful art form, but like, you're sitting outside the grocery store with a little hat. That's it. And you know, trying to get people to listen people to your walking poems. by. Yeah, it's uh, I'm going home with Wow, you gotta have nerves of steel. And What's my go to karaoke song? Oh, this uh, is good. So I would say Spice Girls. Oh, oh I'll wow. tell you what to It's a very good choice. That's right? Blake. That's you Blake, would go though. for it. No, that's all Blake. She would only <laughs> like the Spice Girls catalog. Yeah, I can see that. Go. Are you kidding me? 
Yeah. You, you can't. She, she knows more about the Spice Girls than the Spice Girls. Do. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. I, I would guess. say. Wrong, though. Oh, wrong? Yeah, yeah. Sure. But, wrong. So close, totally wrong. so close, so close, though. I think I'm right. Yeah. Two songs. Mm -hmm. Staying Alive. That's a good one. Wow. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. <laughs> right? And the other one is a little classic, I'm sure you know. It's uh, called Baby I Love You from the Yahoos. Baby I Love You, wow. but Leave Me the Fuck Alone. Yes. Right? How did you <laughs> I like that last oh, part. Oh, baby, I love you. Just right. leave me the fuck alone. It I don't know. Damn. Uh, you guys are both so wrong. Um, it's uh, <laughs> it's Hold On by Wilson Phillips. Oh, oh good. I know that there is pain. What is my favorite workout? God. I think it's Pilates and yoga. Meh, Shit. wrong. <laughs> I think it's uh, she likes to throw that squat rack on her back and get 400 pounds up. Or Zumba? <laughs> Zumba. Zumba. Love Zumba. What? Hey, I might Never be done close. it, but I hear it's great. Oh, no, uh, no. no, I love to do uh, like gym work, but I love to do abs work. It pays off. Ab work? Mm -hmm. Really? Abdominal workout. Wow, yes. never, never you done never one of those. You guys, you need to get to yeah. know me a little bit better. Ryan gets on my shoulders and I squat. <laughs> yeah. And then, and then I get on his knees. He squats I too. love sneaking to the Iron Paradise <laughs> where no one's there. I wear nothing but a shirt. And Literally. I yeah. hit every machine I possibly can, particularly the leather ones. What's something that always makes me laugh? Oh. Hey, baby, I'm ugly. I'm poor. It's uh, zero to zero to zero. Of course. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so at the beginning, I wrote a sincere answer his daughters, his kids, right? But then they started laughing, <laughs> so I wrote, seeing Ryan working out. Wow. Oh, that's right? good. One th I, what I think makes DJ laugh is my bad impression of him. <laughs> like when I do an impression of him, because I would do that when we're shooting the movie, there were so many things that I, we were, I was just doing it to make him laugh. And I, you know, we were wa literally wasting Netflix's time and money because the, none of this is ever gonna make it into the movie. And I would do that for him, and, and he would crack up because it was just it was dreadful. By the way, it's the truth. So I wrote Red Notice Daily <laughs> because <laughs> with these guys on set every day, oh my God, yeah. so fucking funny. And there was one that one scene where I, I turned to him, and, and we were talking to you, and I said, why didn't you tell me about the egg? Oh, yeah. And he went, I don't <laughs> know why, why didn't I tell you about the egg? Oh, my God. <laughs> yeah. God, yeah, his yeah. impression is beautiful. Terrible, but it's beautiful. But, uh, <laughs> yeah. What's the one thing I spend the most money on? Hmm. What do you have? <laughs> <laughs> what is, you really wrote an essay. I did. <laughs> All right. Well, I said uh, hookers and blow. <laughs> but. I, I would not associate with hookers. <laughs> but, Blows, uh, however. But I put just kidding. <laughs> just kidding. Very important that everybody sees. Traveling home to see his family is what he spends the most money on. And when I know I, that for when I'm at home, nestled in with the kids, and we're watching this interview, it is going to be amazing. <laughs> it is going to be amazing. What is, what is, who are? Hookers and blow. What is, yeah. Daddy, what does that mean? What, what does Maui mean by hookers and blow? I agree with uh, DJ. It's probably traveling back home to see his family, but I would say pies. And yeah. I would say mixers. Ooh. I love pies. I know you do. And I love mixers. I know you do. Not the party, just like I don't like know mixers. if it's something you really, it's not like expensive. Well, like you, you, you can spend a lot of money on the right kind of pie. Good drink if the pie, pie is made entirely oh. of cocaine, it is <laughs> yes. very expensive. Uh, okay. hookers, very yes. expensive baked goods. Um, I, I was going to say uh, vasectomies that clearly don't work. <laughs> but it was actually sneakers. Sneakers is the thing I spend oh. the most money. Yeah, it's like a, it's like a, yeah, it's too, yeah, I gotta stop. You gotta, you gotta think. Yeah, it's like I got only two feet. It's like, what's the point? You know, come on. <laughs> whoa, whoa, what? Hey. How'd that happen? Wow. Look at that. Wow. I like it. Some points. It's all just. It's all about the process, guys. <laughs> <laughs> it was just as much fun to play. It really was. I wasn't even thinking about winning. No one's competitive here. Got no one. No. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you for watching. Thanks a lot for watching.